The internet as we know it today is an astounding success. More than 1.3 billion people are connected to the web across the globe. In 2006, 161 exabytes of information were created or replicated worldwide. IDC estimates an increase of over six times this metric by 2010 to 988 exabytes or a zettabyte a year. More generic estimates are that while currently new technical information doubles every two years, by 2010 this will be every 72 hours. The development is driven by users as well as by technology. Web 2.0 changed users to creators of content. Platforms like MySpace, seen as a country it would be the fourth largest in the world with 250 million registered users, are going to transform the traditional ways of making business connections, networking and community building. Whilst the number of users and the amount of content is growing faster and faster, the internet is departing from computers. More than 1 billion users of mobile phones already have the opportunity to access the internet, and this number will grow to 4 billion within the next few years. New technologies are changing the way we use the net. Intelligent devices, clothes, fridges, machines and factories are connected and interact automatically without direct human involvement. This will revolutionize the consumer market as the internet becomes the fundamental economic instrument. Consumers will depend entirely upon network services and businesses will depend entirely upon the future internet to provide these services. But since the current internet consists of mostly unstructured data and resources, most of the data and resources are unusable for the average user. Fact is, the internet is broken. We still have not one web, but a vast variety of different unlinked data that is unable to communicate. That's why future internet will have to change, and change it will. For the new internet to be usable, we have to be able to delegate tasks to machines. The key problem here is how do we share meaning across the globe? When my machine on one side of the globe says the term bank, how does a machine on the other side of the globe understand that it means a financial institution and not the side of a river? Unless we integrate semantic technologies into the future internet, it will not be usable. We are currently rethinking the web on various levels. We are preparing for a web of things. All electronic devices will be active participants in the future Internet. The Internet of Things is a very important part of the future Internet. In the Internet of Things we have a lot of real-world objects like cars and machines and uh, things in the supply chain which will be monitored directly. The things that we have, they are connected through services to the business systems, to the business operations, in order to provide, for example, higher visibility, um, thereby leading to improvements in business operations, in, um, for example, in manufacturing. And we believe that this will significantly shape the future of the internet. Content of things and content of people. User-generated content will grow significantly and will be a driving force in future internet. Collaborative business models and social network application tools will make the future internet run with fewer barriers than we face today. Semantic technologies will support these tools. Everything and everybody will be connected. The future internet will also reorganize publicity, privacy and anonymity, where everybody can understand how much trust can and should be extended to others. Everything, everywhere, always. We must imagine future internet as a service. Mobile, ubiquitous and pervasive. 24-7 availability will be the norm. To sustain the demands of the future internet, networks must be re-engineered. We need new networks which integrate all kinds of devices and which allow the most auspicious vision of future internet. The internet of services will bring an enormous increase in the efficiency of economic processes. Business processes are unified in services that can be used by different groups of people within a company or enterprise or externally via the internet of services. Soon, redundantly providing the same information again and again will no longer be necessary. Semantics will provide secure and efficient access to a coordinated set of services that are not location dependent, are interoperable, coherent, consistent, scalable, pervasive and reliable. These services will be networked together through the future internet. The digital information revolution is upon us. It will be built around an internet of services which will depend on an internet mobile as well as an internet of things. Tomorrow, every carton of milk will be on the internet. See you on the net. 
The Future Internet is a major European initiative currently supported by means of 70 projects with a combined value of 500 million euros. Our vision of the future internet relies on a global collaborative effort. Visit the website, join the interest group, be part of it. Join us in shaping tomorrow's world today.